Hello humans and welcome back to Space Engineers Season 3 Episode 48. Oh my god. This morning. Uh, Alright, so my world became corrupted. And I didn't have a backup. Yep. So, uh, I got everything back though. We're good. What, what happened was I was flying out our resupply ship back out to the moon again. I brought like 5,000 uh, steel plates and a thousand uh, large steel tubes and all kinds of good stuff. So I got all the drills replaced. But anyways, my world was corrupted. I was flying out here. There is pirates that way. Uh, there's a raider outpost. And I got within like 16 kilometers of them. Then I started flying away. Once I hit about 20 kilometers, uh, the game crashed. Went to load it back up, and it said my world was corrupted. Yay! So, I went in uh, SE Toolbox. I exported everything. <laughs> except for the planets. I exported everything. Uh, all the large ships, uh, the pirate ships, everything that was out in the world that was created. Even the space junk, my crash ships. I exported it all and I imported it into one of my old saves and just pasted everything over top of it. So we got set back a little bit. The cement blocks on Earth Base 1 did not uh, get transported by SE Toolbox. It didn't like those blocks so Earth Base 1 now has uh, no launch platform but that's fine. Everything else is here and connected and all good. I did have to uh, add my waypoints back, so that's why they're in different places. Because I had to fly around. If you use uh, Alt F10, if you go into creative mode and then you just go to like... Yeah, this is out there. I don't know why this is out there. But yeah, here, if you want to spawn here, uh, Alt F10 and get rid of that. Uh, right now it's in spectator mode. If you hit, uh, let's uh, get a little closer to the ground so I don't fall to my death. Uh, if you hit control and space, and then F6 to get out of spectator mode, this is, you spawn here. Alright, so let's uh, go back to here. I'll F10. Let's uh, spawn me back over here. Actually, it should be okay. And then F6. Yeah. So that's how you teleport your character around the different grid. Oh. This is all beat up. Probably from me driving around like a maniac. I can't even fix it. But anyways, uh, my jetpack is off. And you still hear air. Whooshing around. Which is really odd. And yeah, that's where Lunar Base 1 was. Yeah. You hear that? Why'd you pay? On, off. There should be no wishing sounds. Anyways, um, I replaced all these with drills. So now... Um, wait, did I... Ah, uh, I didn't change that. Alright, let's uh, hop in here. Go control panel, let's hide and let's type in piston. And let's just go through each one. Can I just hit the down arrow? No. Just see if there is one that is not owned by me. It's said in the comments that there was one, someone saw one briefly. This, what's wrong with this one? Why doesn't this one have a position? One Bravo. I'm betting. Which one are you? Whoops. You have one Alpha. You have one Charlie. Yeah, one Bravo. Ah, this one's not complete. All right, let's go grab eight large steel tubes. 
We. I'm guessing that's going to be the issue on another one or two. Oh, I'm going to put these back. I've used up quite a bit of supplies. Uh, one Bravo. There we go. So if we go look at all these piston heads. Just in part is good. Let's just... That one's good. That one's good. That one's good. That one's good. Oh, come on. Oops. That one's good. That one's good. Alright, those are all good. Let's go check these. That's good. That's good. That's good. That one's not. Haha. <laughs> so I've missed a few piston heads. Oop, the wrong way. That's all good. Whoop, a little too fast. That's good. That's good. Whoop, that's good. And oop, fast it. That's good. Ah, dang! How many pistons are there? Oh, there's there's ten. That's how many there are. And last group. Let's check this one real quick. That's good. Make sure all these pistons are good. Yeah, so if your world gets corrupted, uh, use SE Toolbox, copy everything out, and put it in a new, put it in a old save. If that ever happens to you, that's what I did. It worked. Export and then import. All right, everything looks like it's good. Let's go back down here. All right, um, inventory. Uh, we want to do large cart. Oh, it's all in large. Can I go from here to here? Ah! It goes from the drills all the way to large cargo. Okay, we are we are golden. All right. Uh, what was I hitting V for? So let's uh let's go uh, this side. So we turn our drills on, and we hit two. And it's gonna slowly eat its way. Oh, I also took out the speed mod. That was causing... I don't know if it was causing issues, but it's uh, affecting my flights. Uh, a few of you, well, quite a few of you said that my speed going in back to the planet is what uh, stopped the Atmo thrusters from working. So, got rid of those, and I was too high up. I just want to get a little bit of platinum to take with us. Uh, control panel. Uh, show, don't show hidden box. Piston group one. Oh, it's not going to show me the, the distance. Uh, I can look at inventory. So we're just getting stones. So I should go all the way down. Uh, shift three? No, shift two. Whoa. 
That thing is really bouncy. Alright, shift one. I think it's fully extended. Maybe? Ah, let's extend it some more. What's the worst that could happen? It's not like this took, you know, three ships worth of resources or anything, you know? There you go. Mind your way down. You don't look like you're moving. Move. It's going to explode. There it goes. Whoa. Ah. Okay, um, the camera view is horrible, just so you know. Are we getting any... We're just getting stone right now. Tons and tons of stone, come on. Alright, large ships can drill at one meter a second, but... Piston-driven drills cannot drill at 0.1 meters a second for some reason. You figured they'd be able to move at one meter a second. Uh, let's extend you. I did hit four, right? Yeah, there it goes. There you go. Eat your heart out. Nom 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 nom. I'm surprised this thing hasn't exploded. Alright, so we went 10, 20 meters down. We're going 30 meters now. So the plan is to have buttons to set for each uh, meter, or each 10 meter increments. So if I want this to go down 10 meters, uh, it's going to require some uh, timer blocks set up for each piston group. But I think I can set them up so, you know, if I hit, you know, button 1, it's going to go 10 meters. Button 2 is going to... Uh, Activate piston one and set timer block one. Cyber timer block one is going to take 12 seconds or so. Oh no, no. Wait, if it's going 10 meters at 0 0.1 meters a second, that's 100 seconds. So yeah, timer block one will be delayed like 105 seconds and it'll activate piston two. And I plan to use, because it's going to take a lot of uh, timer blocks, so I plan on doing the attaching small ship timer blocks to this. So that way I don't have to have, you know, 50 t large ship timer blocks everywhere. And the plan is to set it to go down to depth. See, this says that... Uh, Platinum is 113 meters down, which I do not believe at all. But that's where it says it is. We're getting nickel now. Nice. Just show the cargo. There we go. That's number four. It's still extending. Is it? Looks like it stopped. Five. There it goes. So I probably shouldn't be doing this with the really weak uh, bracing supports in there. Because they're probably going to shatter. <laughs> but yeah, it's it's prototype. And it'll just uh, mine down for quite a ways. Just give me a little bit of platinum. That's all I ask. 
Oh, we got three million stone, three hundred and fifty-four thousand nickel, which is really good. So this is getting quite a bit of materials. We just did number five, right? So it's number six. Oh wait, no, it's it's still going. It's gonna be a while. Give us some time. So 10, 20, 30, yeah, this is 40 meters down now. Two, so we gotta hit uh, number five next. I don't know. Control panel, number five is Oh, okay. So we did ten, one, two, three, four. Yeah, number five, or number six is next. One, two, three, four. Yeah, number six. I'm trying to keep track here. Alright, and we will hit the button and. Still no nickel, or yeah, no nickel. Whoa! Oh my god, the lag is real. Why is there sound over here? Oh my god, the lags. There it is. Yeah, the platinum is 131 meters down. We're chewing through the nickel now. Oh, so slow. So loud. Ugh. That's better. Jeez. We just hit number six, right? I don't know. Ah. Uh, I just don't want this to fill up. No, don't make noises. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, we hit number six. Number seven is next. But we can see if it, it starts expanding the wrong section, we know we did it wrong. Uh, okay, well, that would be an issue. Uh, these two pistons are not connected at all. So we look at this one, it's not connected. And we look at this one. It's not connected. We look at these, and they're good. See, current position attached. Don't know why these ones detached to begin with. Are you de are attached now? No. Oh, I shouldn't have done it. Oh well. Anyways, um, everything is retracting now. So for some reason, uh, the first two ones broke. Come on up, you. I need to get down there. I don't think we got any, uh... Uh, inventory. Hide empty. Yeah, we didn't, we didn't get any platinum. And for some reason, it's still being able to travel down the pipes, uh... I don't know, it makes no sense to me. But hey, it is... Oh, I think, no, because the top isn't built. Oh. We got plenty of fuel. We... So here's all the... Yeah, see that, that there? And it said there was platinum. Right over here. Let's see. Can we get to it? Give me the platinums. There's probably nothing here. It's a fake marker. That's my guess. Show me platinum. Whoa. 
Yeah. That's stone. Is that platinum? Get out of the way. It is. The platinum is here. The platinum is real. All right. Let me uh, just grab some of this. Get out of the way. There we go. Ah. Uh, I just want as much platinum as I can get. Uh, drop this stone. No, pick up the platinum. Pick up the platinum. There we go. Let's get out of here. Oh, yeah. It wasn't a fake one. It was real. But, ow. So this design works. Top of it needs to be fixed, which is annoying. It's not easy to do. Alright, this platinum's coming with me. Uh, did I make... I made some steel plates, didn't I? My inventory is full, it doesn't matter. Anyways, it's time to try to land at Earth Base 2. Third attempt. Alright, who's got money on me making it? I do. Alright, let's uh... Oh, I was carrying all this stuff. I could have got a lot more platinum. I got a refinery on this. I do not. All right, um, here. Nope. Right there. There you go. I should have emptied my inventory before I went down there. Oh, I was going to check this. I thought I made steel plates. I did. That's all I got. Yeah. Anyways. Okay. 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 There we go. Alright. Um, seven. Five. Straight to the planet. That is so not even close to straight. Oh well. Notion definitely is off. We're going this way. We should have enough to get into orbit. Or escape the atmosphere. The planetary gravity. Whatever you want to call it. Yeah, we're not slowing down that fast. We should be good. I think it's like 30. Yeah. 29. 22.9 kilometers. Alright, uh, let's get back up to full speed. There we go. And is... I don't want to see hidden stuff. Our hydrogen tank, it's getting full. Just want to make sure that's full before I turn off the uh, oxygen generator again. All right, attempt number three: Will we survive? That is the question. All right, we're in the atmosphere finally. Turn the oxygen generator on. And at uh, 15 kilometers, I'm going to kick on the hydrogen engines. The Atmos are on right now, but they're not doing anything. Probably because we're way up in space still. They probably only work below cloud, cloud level. Which you guys were all telling me in <coughs> the comments. They, they only work like a, a one kilometer from the ground. So, yeah, there are really fast slowdown, hopefully. And our ship is a little heavy. We got tons of materials and ice and construction components. Wow, we used up uh, 100k, 70, 60, 60k of ice. Wow. And 
we're, we're falling at a nice slow pace compared to the 350 meters I went last time. But yeah, it looks like we're going to be in a pretty good landing place. It will only be a hundred kilometers from the moon instead of where Earth Base 2 is, which comes out to be about 300 kilometers by flying around the planet to get to the moon. It's it's a long trip. This will make everything a lot easier once we get down here. Oh wait, what's my distance? Ooh, uh, five. That's not slowing us down at all. There we go. Just face up. Slow down. I'll do it the same way I landed on the moon. Is I just slow down to... Oh, we're not... Slow down. There we go. I, I slowed down to 10 meters a second, kicked off the engines, slowed down to, or sped up to 20, like so. Turn it back on. Turn them off. Turn them on. And this seemed to work the best. Gets us nice and slow and sit. Oh, uh, pay attention to what you're doing. Actually, 30s. Oh, I don't have the. Oh, crap. Um, crap. Crap. Our, our tank empty, didn't it? Uh, it did because uh, I did way too much at once. Alright, turn those off. Oh, God. No, I don't want to die. Slow us down. Alright. We can't <laughs> we can't slow down. Uh this is gonna be bad. Dang it. Slow us down. Uh come on oxygen generator. Give me give me a ton of slow down speed. Really soon. I need it. I really need it. Uh come on. I don't wanna crash again. And right there. There you go. There you go. They slowing us down. Slow us down, slow us down, slow us down. Come on. Slow us down. We're not slowing down at all. Slow down! Come on! Burn off the speed! No! Wait. Oh, those are the stupid ships that showed up. I don't know where these ships came from. <sighs> Alright, you know what we're gonna do? No, I don't know what to, how to do this. <gasps> oh! You know what might help? Hmm. Alright, if, if I keep the boosters and take those with me to the moon, right? Uh, no, this space, yeah. Wait. Yeah, our, our, our launch pad is gone. Everything else stayed, even these blocks, they're floating in the air. This uh, fell to the ground. 
But yeah, they're they're just floating up there, so they shouldn't be. <laughs> I bet you if I put something on them, they'll fall down. Oh, what the heck? Oh my god! Oh Jesus! All right, uh, let's just uh, delete all this. Why? Why have I been in creative mode? Oh my god, I've been cheating this whole time and I didn't even know it. Oh, well, it's a good thing I... I actually, I don't think it did. Did it help me at all? No, I still crashed and blew up my ship. Alright, yeah, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to rebuild the ship. Uh, without a launch pad. Uh, fuel it up and hope for the best. Alright, that is it for today. Uh... Next episode... God, that's such a long flight. Oh, I don't want to make that flight again. Alright. Yeah, I can't build now. Man. I so don't want to make that flight again. But I'm going to have to do it, and I'm going to keep the boosters. I'm going to attach the boosters to the... The tank, or to the, the ship there. Well, I'm just going to leave them attached instead of uh, deleting the refuel tube. Well, grinding it down anyways. So, and we're launching into space and I'll have enough ice to refuel the booster while we're in space. And then we can fly from the moon and land safely. I think that's our only option without having um, ion thrusters. Well, no, ion thrusters would not help us at all on the planet, would they? No. They slow us down in the upper atmosphere, but not the lower atmosphere. Alright, so that's the plan. I'm going to keep the booster, fly all the way to the moon, land on the moon, and I'll meet you on the moon with the, the whole ship with the boosters. Alright, thank you all for watching. Take care.